after several years of working with the batteries and with everything what is related to it, uh, I have several things that I really hate. And the first thing which came to my mind right now is actually the carbon. I really hate the carbon because the carbon is black and after several years of working with the carbons uh, I really hate that they are black color. Because when I make some major development and I use a lot of carbon then all my working area is really really messy and everything is black including me. And for this reason I really hate that the color of the carbon is black. So it will be a little bit refreshing right now if the color will be, I don't know, some white color or even pink. The pink will also be really great. But for now with the color of the carbon I cannot do very much and for this reason I will move to my second hate which is the washing of the materials. So most of the time I need to wash the materials like active materials and so on and for this reason when I wash the material I also need to make some filtration and if I make some gravity filtration then this filtration needs some really really long time so here I have my funnel and my uh, filter paper inside I will fill with some material like this one But now I want to make a little bit faster filtration and for this reason I will make myself some vacuum filtration funnel. And after printing with the resin printer, I make myself two vacuum filtration funnels in two different sizes. So here uh, I can connect some silicon tube with the whole dimension of four millimeters. Like so. 
and to this end I will connect to my pump. So here I have some uh, pump which I get uh, on eBay. So this one is uh, I think yeah 12 volts. Okay, here I have my vacuum filtration panel, which is connected with this silicone uh, pipe, and this pipe is connected to my 12 volt pump. Uh, then inside of this funnel, I put this filter paper, and then this funnel I also uh, insert into this container. So here in this this area, I need to make sure that I will get some really good uh, seal. For this reason, I need to push the funnel a little bit into this container. But if you cannot manage some good seal in this area, then you can also use some electrical tape. Like so, for example. Water. And now I will turn on my power supply. So guys, this was my 3D printed Wacom filtration funnel. And yeah, so this one is made from resin. Uh, I use ABAs like resin because the resin is a little bit more resistant to the chemicals like some PLA or PETG. In the future I also will replace uh, this one with a little bit better pump. But for now this one will be okay. Uh, so guys, if you want to make uh, this kind of vacuum filtration funnel by yourself, then the STL files will be uh, on the Maker's World or on my Patreon. The links will be in the video description. So for me, this was some interesting weekend project and that's it. So we see us in the next video. Bye.